Hey everyone, if you want to learn how to be a hacker or if you are a security professional and would like to have your own playground, a safe space where you can try things, break things and experiment with different fixes, this video is for you. I will show you how to set up your very own hacker lab at home with OWASP Choose Shop. It's an insecure web application that you can host locally so you can hack it legally. So let's dive in. Okay, first, let me give you a quick look at the architecture we'll be working with. Basically, we need to install OWASP Juice Shop on a Linux. I recommend we do it on a virtual machine, so it's like a fortress for you where everything stays isolated and if you mess things up, you can just restore a snapshot and start fresh. You can technically use any Linux distro and any virtualization software, but I will be using VirtualBox with Kali Linux, my go-to combo. Kali comes preloaded with tons of tools we need for hacking. It's basically the Swiss army knife for ethical hackers. So first, let's boot our Kali Linux VM. If you don't have a Kali Linux running on a VM yet, I've already made a video on how to install Kali Linux 2025 in VirtualBox. I will leave the link in the description. Check out that link, get that installed, and then come back here because now here we are all about OWASP Juice Shop. Okay, we are in, so let's open the terminal and then run sudo apt-get update, insert your sudo password here, press enter, and then enter again to confirm. Now let me clear this screen. So OWASP Juice Shop has two requirements, Node.js and NPM, so let's install them first. So sudo apt-get install Node.js. Then press enter and enter to confirm. Okay, now let's confirm whether it has been installed correctly. Just run uh, nogs-v, then press enter. You see here version 20.19.0, so it's all good. Maybe your version there will be different depending on when you are watching this video, but that's fine. Now let's install npm. Just run sudo apt-get install npm, then press enter, and enter again to confirm. Okay, so let's double check whether it has been installed correctly. So just type npm-v, press enter. Yeah, all good. Version 9.2.0 here. Now let's open Firefox and go to the juice shop GitHub repo at github.com slash juice shop slash juice shop again. I'm leaving the link for you in the description. Okay, so here we click on code and copy this HTTPS URL here. Now let's go back to the terminal. And here I recommend we first make a directory called repos and cd into it. So run make dir repos, press enter, and then cd repos and enter again. Okay, now type git clone and paste the URL we copied from juice shop repo and press enter. Now let's cd into juice shop, so type cd juice shop, press enter. And then let's install OWASP Juice Shop by running npm install, press enter. Guys, this installation will now take a while and it's a good time for me to thank you guys for all the love on my last video, seriously. But also make sure you subscribe to my channel, this is a new channel and I'll be posting a lot of interesting content here every Tuesday. But because my channel is less than a month old, YouTube probably won't recommend them to you unless you hit that subscribe button and maybe the notifications bell as well to get notified whenever I upload a new video and stay tuned. And also don't forget to smash that thumbs up button to keep support the channel. Thank you guys for all the support. Guys, if you come across some network error like this, check whether your connection is working and make sure you are not running any proxy during this installation. And then I recommend you completely remove this juice shop directory and go back to the git clone step. 
Okay guys, after installation is complete, obviously don't worry about these vulnerability warnings here, that's the whole point, right? Now from the instructions there on the repo, you can just run npm start. So let's do that. npm start, press enter. And tada, Juice Shop is up and running. And you see here, it's listening on port 3000. So here on the instructions on the repo, you see that you just need to go to localhost column 3000 on Firefox and that's it. We are in, it's really that easy. So guys, as you can see, it's basically a simple web application, a juice shop, but now it's your playground to hack, explore and learn. If you find any vulnerabilities there, leave a comment and share them with us. Happy hacking. Guys, if you like this content, remember to like this video to support the channel, subscribe, turn on notifications and see you next video.